we're used to the different ways that we can arrange our calendar in Outlook. So we've got day, week, work week and month. But did you know there are more choices? So let's say, actually I want to see what I'm doing for the next two weeks. Over here in the date navigator, all I need to do is to actually select and I get my two weeks. Easy as that. However, there's more. Hi, I'm Michelle, computer trainer, here sharing tips and tricks to make working with your everyday programs as easy as possible. So, while we've got two weeks, we've got other options as well. For example, I can choose just two days. I can choose actually four days. So, um, whatever I can select, basically, I can go up to. And this goes up to a maximum of 14 days. So, two weeks, in other words. However, there is an extra little trick because it doesn't have to be adjacent dates. They don't have to be next to each other. Choose a date, hold down the control key on your keyboard and now use the mouse to select whichever dates you want in whatever order you want. Now they, they will always go in date order anyway but you can click and select a whole bunch of different dates to see what you've got. So maybe you've been asked what are you doing on Tuesday over the, the next few weeks, you can just select the Tuesdays. Whatever date you want, as really quick and easy as that. Now you may be wondering, how do I go back to normal? Just click on a different date and you can see it goes back and I can just choose my arrange options to return back to my preferred view. If you like this tip, please give it a thumbs up. It really does help my channel. And if you'd like to be notified of more videos as they become available, please remember to subscribe. That's everything for today. See you next time.